How's she sound? Perfect. The first time we tried, I had a miscarriage. It's something that you can't control. Yeah. The IVF doctor there was just like, I see a lot of women coming into my office who look great, they look young, but you know, their ovaries suck. He said that. There's something happening when it comes to giving birth in America. So what if a woman puts her career first? So what if she wants to be successful? And now all of a sudden I'm at a place where I'm having to spend thousands of dollars to preserve my fertility. There was a time in America when most births took place outside of hospitals. What happened? Money. We have this fear that now triggers that fear, and every one of those fears becomes more and more expensive. To the point where the United States has become the priciest place to give birth in the world. But women aren't taking it lying down. Pregnant workers shouldn't have to choose between their jobs and a healthy pregnancy. Having contractions about every 10 minutes and they don't feel good. A lot of people are tired of being told how to birth. <laughs> and they're redefining what it means to be pregnant. I don't think there's any one day where you say, hey, I want to be a surrogate. And what's it like to be carrying a Chinese baby? <laughs> it's a girl. It really is science fiction. We're living in the future. <laughs> what is birth? It is a leap of faith. This is a bruiser right here. <laughs> this is birth.